Hi everyone, thanks for checking out the prepaid expense reconciliation. This is just going to be a quick video showing how the prepaid expense reconciliation works. So the way that this reconciliation works is based off of the number of days that are covered by your prepaid item. So whenever you download your prepaid expense reconciliation, it's going to look like this. It's going to have the vendor, the description, invoice, amount, beginning coverage date, ending coverage, the expense account you want the expense to hit whenever you record your monthly entry and then it's going to have spaces for the days covered, days expense, days remaining balance, and the monthly expense. So I went ahead and populated um, a, a one of the reconciliations so that we can demonstrate how it works. So as you can see here I've entered about five items and once you enter your items you put in your coverage dates and your ending coverage date and it's going to automatically calculate these amounts over here in green. So once your items are entered, it's going to calculate your monthly expense based on what's entered here. And it's already pre-populated with 2019 through 2025. So all you have to do is select your month end. So say that we want to record the expense for June of 2020. We can select June 30th, 2020 and it's auto automatically going to calculate the balance and the monthly expense entry for you. Say so that you want to calculate July's 2020, it's going to automatically update your balance and calculate your monthly expense here. Move on to August and it is going to calculate that as well. So as you can see, every month it's going to calculate, recalculate your monthly expense and update your balance. And then at the end of the month, whenever you're trying to tie it to your trial balance, you just enter the amount from your trial balance down here. And once your difference is zero, you know that you're reconciled. So that's how the schedule works. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel, check out the rest of our videos, and see what other tools we have available. The link to this download will be in the description, and we'll see you all next time.